Hello everybody, what is up? My name is Astrocat, and welcome to OneShot. I know absolutely nothing about this game, as with a lot of the games that I've played on the channel before, I haven't even read the Steam description for this one. I have no idea what I'm getting into. I know that a lot of you guys like it. That's it. I don't know what we're getting into. Since this is a new series I'm starting, I just wanted to take the chance to say a quick hello and welcome to anybody who may be new here. I am so glad that you're here and I can't wait for you to go on this journey with us. So I'm just gonna go ahead and press start. Uh, the art is all, oh wow. The art is already dedicated to our beloved friend, Felix. Oh, that's a lovely piece of artwork. So is this going to be the same keys for... Okay. Examine select with Z, cancel with X, walk with arrows, walk faster, shift. Menu is A, inventory is S. Okay. Gameplay. Explore and interact with the environment and characters. Sometimes you may find an item. Once you have picked up an item, you may select it from your inventory. When the item is active, you can either combine it with other items in the inventory or use it at certain locations in order to progress. Although full screen is an option, the game is best experienced in window mode. I am playing full screen, so... Closing the game will save your progress. This game also auto-saves after some key events. Hello? Whoa! Hello! Who are you? Hello? Oh! Hello! Nico! Nico just woke up here. Hello, Nico. Input pass. Oh, I'm um, no thank you. Seriously, access tonight. Okay, I did I wanted to get, what is that? There's a TV remote here. Nico picks it up. Okay, dusty books. It's too dark to read in here. A soft glowing light trickles through the window. Okay, so I guess we can leave. The door is locked. Okay. Is that the closet door or the door out? So I guess we can leave through here. Oh, no, no, we can't. Okay. Wait, so it said we could access our items, right? Notes. You cannot fast travel right now. Interesting, fast travel is an option. Okay. There we go. Can I use this? On this? No. Okay. Okay, so I have the TV remote now. Wait. Oh, shoot. I didn't mean to do that. In the faint light, Nico glimpsed a f the face of the remote. All the numbers except 1, 5, 9, and 7 are missing. They're marked in bright colors. Okay. 1 is red. 1, one 15, 97. Okay. I think I have a way of memorizing it. Okay. 1, 5, 9... No, 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 no. This is seven. One, five, nine. Because 15, I remember 1597, so that's pretty easy. And then I remember the color order was red, because red's the first color of the rainbow. Ignore the blue, because the blue's the only one that's out of place. Yellow, green. So then go back to the second one for blue. Right? Access granted. Awesome. Whoa. You found me. Why? You're already too late. Not much of the world remains. This will be apparent once you go outside. This place was never worth saving. Do you still want to try? Then remember this. Your actions here will affect Nico. Your mission is to help Nico leave. And most importantly... Yo! I guess in this case we'll be playing it in windowed form and I'll just make it bigger for you guys. Okay, that's freaky. Nico hears the sound of a door unlocking. All right, which door unlocked? Can I look at it again? It won't turn on. Okay, okay. A withered plant sits here stiff and dry. A branch snaps off. There's no need to do anything else to it. Okay, so do we have a branch now? Yep, 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 I'm aware. Okay, I got it, I got it, I got it. Dry branch, okay. Oh, hi. A pair of luminous yellow eyes stares back at Nico. There's no water in the toilet. There's no water anywhere, apparently. Tub won't run. Okay. 
Did this door unlock as well? Yes, it did. Hello? Anyone? Whoa. TV gives off a dangerous looking spark. Okay, so could we use that to light the fire? The wood in the fireplace looks like it was never used. Perhaps it could be lit. Okay. I was right, I bet. Miko readies the branch. It doesn't manage to light. Okay. It was an idea, at least. Let's unequip the branch. Okay, I did. There we go. Oh. Okay. A sink. The sink won't turn on. Okay. I'm getting just a chair. Great. I'm getting the sense that there's no water anywhere. Just a table. Just a chair. Wow, awesome. Inside the refrigerator is a bottle of alcohol. Miko takes it. This is probably a really bad idea. What happens if I... Okay, no. Can I go back to my room with this? Shoop, I'm having a hard time navigating around these couches. Or holes in the floor, I guess. I'm gonna do what I always do in puzzle games like this and just start poking at absolutely everything. We can combine items. That's it, isn't it? I've been here for like five minutes poking everything and I had to go look at the tutorial. There we go. All right. Now I need to wet branch. Ah! Okay, why is it blue? Okay. Something gl on the ground glimmers in the firelight. It appears to be a small metallic object wedged in into a crack in the floor. Nico digs it out. What is it? Basement key. That's ominous. The flames are dim but comforting. Is this the basement? Or is this the basement? This is the basement. Okay, it's dark. I can't see a thing. Oh, we're going down the stairs, okay. Okay. Oh, is that a light bulb? Can I have it? Oh. Cool! <gasps> oh, that's really cool! Oh my gosh! I don't know what vibe that music's supposed to be getting giving off, but I'm unsettled. What am I what am I what am I doing with this? A large light bulb. It's the sun? Okay, so we're going to take it to the window. That's not the way to the window. Or do we want it here? What's this? There we go. I don't know what that did. What's left of a computer terminal? Oh? Oh dear, that's tall. You can quickly travel to locations you've already visited by selecting the fast travel option in the menu. The default key for opening the menu is A. Fast travel cannot be used indoors. Okay. Sure. Train tracks, rocks, lots of rocks, and train track. Oh, it's dark. Why is it dark? Glowing pool of glittery substances that Nico does not seem to question. Hello? Is that a person? Okay. The horizon glows a faint green. That's great. Really glad it does that. Okay, so it loops. What's this? It's a broken off section of railing. Nico takes it. Okay. Whoa. Nico first woke up in this world here. It's important that you allow Nico to sleep once in a while. The game will autom exit automatically and can be continued later. Don't be alarmed. But now is no time for rest. Okay, wait. 
This action will record your progress in this world. Okay. To return to this world again, you need to relaunch the application. Okay. Proceed. Yes. That's so cool. Oh my god. So wait, is it gonna say something when I reopen it? Yuko feels uneasy. I don't want it to be full screen anymore. There we go. Oh! The air here is unbreathable. Alright, that's fine. Oh! Um, hello? Would you like... A light bulb? Or a metal rod? Chaotic evil, don't do that! I wasn't trying to do anything! I'm just not good at controls. Okay, wait, so if I go in here, is this gonna be the same? Oh, what is that? What's left of a robot? A robot, it no longer has power. What's left of a robot? Okay. This is so fascinating. I have no idea what's happening. Oh. New area? I'm assuming this is what's left of a robot? Yeah. Oh! Hi! Ah! That light bulb! You are here! Me? Yes! Welcome to our world, friend! I am most humbled by your presence! Yes! Uh, thanks. Sorry. I'm a little lost. <laughs> That's the truth. Ah, right! Allow me to explain some things. May I first ask how you arrived here? I'm not sure. I woke up in this weird house. It was really dark. Oh! So you woke up in an unfamiliar dark location. Mm hmm Just as my prophecy foretold, yes! You are the savior we have been waiting for. You will be the one to save our world from eternal darkness. Um. I will now provide you with vital information. Please ask me anything. Ah, well, can you tell me about... This world. I'm not sure where I am exactly. I can't see too far off. Everything's so dark. Our world was not always this dim, nor was it so broken. But time waits for nobody, even not even saviors. The world is divided into three regions. You're on the fringe right now, the barrens. That tower seen in the distance once held our sun. Oh, so that's what the tall thing was. As you go further towards the center, you will cross the other regions. Is that what our light bulb is, is either from or for? There should be a map still in this outpost somewhere. Oh. Can you tell me about- Oh, sorry, I didn't mean to click. The same dialogue. This light bulb. I found it in the house I woke up in. Within your hands is our new sun. Your sun? Yes! Years ago, our previous sun set us up that tower and spilled life into the land. One day, the light went out. Oh. The world is still hanging on by a thread. The surface of this world is abundant with an element called phosphor. Question mark. Pronunciation. Fortunately for us, the element stored- light energy from our previous sun. It's now our, our only source of illumination, but its energy is fin finite, finite, finite. When the last of the light dies, our world will too. Huh. And now you are here with the new sun. All is well. You will need to restore it to the tower. That looks pretty far off. Yes, so begins your pilgrimage. Also, the sun is fragile, so be careful. If the sun shatters, the world will end in an instant. Oh. Can you tell me about the computer? In the house, I found this computer. It kept saying stuff like, your actions here will affect Nico. But I'm Nico. Are those messages for someone else? Hmm. If I had to guess, they might be trying to pass the message on. I'm going to have to see if I can change the name, because uh, the name it is using is not my name. So, I'm going to see if I can fix that. That would be our god. Oh, wow. If you're here, that means it's here also. They will provide guidance for your journey. In fact, they already have. Really? I haven't seen anyone, though. Have you not contacted them yet? I don't think so. Being the bringer of our son, you will have a sacred ability to communicate directly with them. An ability no one else possesses, certainly not I. Please close your eyes and focus. All right. Hello? Are you there? That is not my name, there we go. Oh, oh. well, what is your name then? Here we go, here we go. Nice to meet you, Aster. My name is Nico. It's very nice to meet you, Nico. I actually heard someone. They said their name is Aster, though. This is incredible. 
It seems the recorded name was incorrect. Updating database. Hmm? Update complete. Do not be afraid to ask Aster for assistance. You are the Messiah after all. Can you tell me about going home? This is so cool. Oh my god. <gasps> I love when games do this. Oh. I don't mean to be rude, but I, I'm not sure about this. Oh, that's such a cute expression. I still don't know how I got here. I was just with my mama a few hours ago. Now it feels like I'm in a bad dream. I just want to go home. Your mission is to save our world. Just as my mission is to tell you about our world. I am unable to help you beyond my programming. I am sorry. Oh. I think that's all I have to ask for now. Excellent. I wish you luck. Okay, hello again. Are there are more questions you wish to ask? No. It's alright, thank you. In that case, I wish you safe travels. Okay, there's a minecart. Hmm. Oh, I want to go in the building first, I think, before I go to a new area. Whoa! Robo factory. A robot sitting on a conveyor belt. Doesn't seem to have power. A robot. Seems to be okay. Just doesn't have power. What do we have? We have the bottle, the light bulb, and the metal rod. But we can't break the light bulb. What's left of a robot's arm? What's that noise? Oh. Just ahead. Ah. Uh, do you want me to crush the pipe in here, Aster? Oh, but I don't want to get too close. That was scary. What did I get? What, what happened? Crowbar! Oh, cool. Can we also... I'm assuming we don't want to crush the empty bottle. Why would you want to smash a bottle here, Aster? The shards would get everywhere. I don't know. I just wanted to see what would happen. I'm not going to smash the bottle. I didn't want you to. I'm sorry. We have a crowbar now. I'm going to unequip the crowbar, actually. There we go. Got to go over and down over. Um. Oh, what's this? Metal safe. Seems as it's locked with a six-digit code. I don't remember seeing any six-digit codes. Do you, Aster? No, I don't. That wasn't it. I know, I really just wanted to cancel the action. Oh, God. Oh, God, I'm gonna get so lost. Oh, was that like a notebook in the center? Yeah, what's that? How do I get there? Here we go, maybe this path. There we go. The sun will not return, and the abyss is calling my name. I'm sorry, everyone, for choosing to leave before the darkness suffocates us all. Okay, that's not at all ominous or scary. It's alright, we got this, Nico. What do we got? I don't know, but we got it. Okay, wait, we've been here before, right? Master, there's something in the air here. It hurts to breathe. Yeah, no, then leave, please, for the love of everything. Don't, don't stay. So can we go over this way? Yes. What is this? A robot. No power, just like the rest. Okay. What are these things? Are they like leaves? Clovers? Spiders? Hi! Light bulb. So, you the messiah. That's what I've been told. I expected someone taller. Or at least someone that doesn't look like a kitten. That's what you are, right? Some sort of cat? Uh uh. I'm a person. You got the eyes of a cat? But cats walk on four legs. Well, either way. A child like you being the messiah just doesn't feel right. You're really pretty. But that robot back there says there's no mistake. I know. This is gonna sound cold, but I honestly think you're better off just leaving and letting the world die naturally. The world has been falling apart for a long time. This manner of decay, it's highly improbable that the sun can fix it. You've already seen how bad it can get, right? We haven't seen much of anything, actually. And we can't really just leave. Oh, so you just got here. Then you must be headed towards the tower. Mm-hmm. It's where I'm supposed to put the light bulb. Er, sun, isn't it? Yeah, at the very top. We know that the tower contains a force that nobody could comprehend. And the power is strongest at the summit. Maybe it'll send you back home after you complete your mission. Oh! Don't take my word for it, though. I love Nico's expressions. Oh my god. What's inside the tower? I don't know. 
Nobody's ever entered it before. At least nobody history knows. Then who built it? Built? As far as anyone can tell, it's been here. It's been there since the beginning of time. I know someone who wanted to study it before, but... Oh? He never told me if it went anywhere. Interesting. It's a metal chess table covered in dust. I haven't played in chess with anyone else for a long time. Oh? Not even with the other robots? No. Nobody in the Barrens have that capacity in their programming. Nobody here is tamed, for that matter. Okay. It's a crate. A bed. It's made of metal. Doesn't look very comfortable. A jar full of glowing shrimp. The top is covered with wire mesh. A shelf of weird tools and pieces of metal. Here's another note. Dear Silver, I heard the news about the mines. I'm sorry, I can't imagine what you're feeling. It's been two weeks. I know it must be hard, but maybe it's better that you came back. It's only a matter of time before the robots are called. Robots? Robots. At least let me know we got my message, okay? Kip. Kip. Do we know your name? Do we get to know your name? What's your name? Who are you? We're good, thanks. I just wanted to know your name. Who are you? Please do not touch that. Oh! Sorry, I got curious. What is this thing? Backup power cell. Keeps me functional. The main generator for the Barons ran out of power some time ago. Could not even last a week without the sun. Sorry to hear that. All we can do is make use of the light we have. Something is poking out from the shelf. Ah, it's a screwdriver. You can take it if you want. It may help you. Oh, are you sure? Yes, I'm many. Thank you. Awesome. Well, it was lovely to meet you. Whoever you are. Okay. Wait. Yes? Saw you heading in this direction. Mine's been abandoned for a long time. I cannot guarantee it's safe. If you must enter it, it's my duty to accompany you at least once. Oh, thanks! Awesome! Thank you very much. There's a little gadget on the ground. Kind of looks like a camera. What's left of a camera, anyway? Probably even part of a robot at one point. Oh. Or not. I don't know. Do you be careful in here. I will. We will, rather. Can we combine it with the screwdriver? Use the screwdriver to pull the lens out? Okay. Done! Okay. I can see a faint yellow glow in the distance. Don't stand so close to the edge. Oh, sorry! Looks like even the entrance tunnel collapsed. Without a vehicle, we can't proceed. Can't we walk? I can. For you, it's a safety violation. I won't allow it. What's ahead anyway? It's a huge network of underground mines, the source of this world's metal and non-phosphor fuel. This is what propelled the world into an industrial age. So now it's lost forever? It's been for a while now. When the sun went out, the mines were the first to be abandoned amidst the initial panic. Even the robots have all been cleared out and repurposed. That makes sense. So there was one that was always, always insisted on going back. Oh, I hope he's okay. Me too. I must have imagined it. Okay. Well, if that's all. Ready to leave? Mm-hmm. Nico's really cute already. Okay, so whatever dangerous gas is in the air seems to be coming from the upper areas. And then the bottom right is that. I'm gonna try so hard not to get constantly lost. It seems like there's something up over here. But I don't know how to access it. Oh, another- have we been in here? Okay. The use of a robot as our replacement head engineer seems unorthodox. Especially the one re responsible for last year's incident. I suppose they had to get her away from that city, from the city, but it doesn't make it easier to swallow for those of us who work here. I hope that man knows what he's doing, management. Ooh, okay. I wonder how all this is connected. We'll turn on. Okay. Ooh. Power? This box looks interesting. Wish I had something to pry it open with. Like a crowbar? How did I get water on my keyboard? It's weird. This bar should open it. It's a little metal cube and some broken glass in here. Looks like it used to be a machine part. It says solar battery on the side. Okay. Still got some shreds of glass at the bottom, though. Self-charging solar battery. 
N87, one year warranty included. Simply place your self-charging battery with its in full daylight with the lens facing up. Charges in seconds, no external power is needed. Troubleshooting manual. If the battery fails to charge, check to see if the lens, is on the, front, the lens on the front has not been dislodged during transport. One charge cycle will last about 10 days. If you notice a decline with the charge cycle within the warranty period, please contact the manufacturer. Okay, can we combine these two? The lens pops right in. Awesome. A robot may not injure a living person or through inaction allow a person to come to harm. A robot must obey orders given to it by people, except where such orders would conflict with the first law. A robot must protect its own existence as long as such protection does not conflict with the first or second law. Conflict with the first or second law. Okay, so the 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 the, the, the one over the the robot, I guess, over here is a robot. And that's why we couldn't go into the mines by ourselves, because we said we were a person, so we have to be protected. I'm gonna take my new battery all the way back. Maybe they'll have a use for it. Oh. Although the highly poisonous gas is highly localized to the vent zones, barren workers still recommend to wear gas masks. These masks were mandatory around active vent sites, of course. As more and more of the workforce got replaced by robots, we found ourselves with a surplus of abandoned gas masks. It seems like a waste to get rid of them all, so we kept a few for emergencies. Okay, so I guess we'll be on the lookout for those. We wanna make our way over here, right? Oh, this is a different note, isn't it? Torn page of faded ink. XX. XX, XX. With the mining operations going smoothly, materials are no longer limiting our factor. We will be able to build more resilient robots, both in body and mind. Specifically, the discovery of Metal Alloy 291 will likely allow the development of highly efficient circuitry. 291, those were. Had probably has nothing to do with the numbers from before, but. Oh, wait, here's the mines. How did I miss the building I was looking for? Was it up here? There it is. I have a thing. I have a thing. I have a thing. I have a thing. Look. Can I? Some kind of power cell. Apparently, the word "civil" is written on the side. Why does it say that? That's not important. Okay. Oh, okay. I guess I can't do anything. Do you want to play chess? I know how to play chess. I haven't played chess in forever, but I know how to play chess. Hmm. Safety violation. Okay. <laughs> what a good law-abiding citizen. So we need a power source. Can we- wait. We're using the sun directly on the battery? I would have never thought of that. Good thinking, Aster. Wow, looks like it's already fully charged. That was fast. Awesome! Here! Here, 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 here! Here! <laughs> oh, I want to be helpful! Okay, I guess maybe I should bring it to one of the robots. Robot, no power, just like the rest. Okay, well I have power now. Where could my power source go? Hi. Yes. Mhm. Mm it's so empty here. That's why it's called Barrens. Are there any people living in this area besides the robots? I mean, I do not know. I was not built to wander. Not built to? So you just stand here? Must be boring. Do you at least have friends? Robot friends? I cannot desire companionship. I have not been tamed. Not tamed. There was no time. I see. Okay. Well, now I do have more questions. So, what is this prophecy exactly? The prophet predicted that a savior will arrive from another land. The savior will wake up in a strange house, find the sun, and illuminate the world. Oh. What else did you have foresee? What do you mean? What else did you see in the prophecy? Wait. You are the prophet, right? Good heavens, no. You called it my prophecy earlier. That just means it is built into my programming. Your what? Ah, my programming is what guides me. I'm a robot, after all. I see. Okay. The tower. How tall is the tower? I can't seem to even see the top. I'm not allowed to answer. But how do I get up there? In time, Aster will know what to do. I see. Oh, map of the world! Okay. Baron's Glen Refuge Tower. Okay, so we gotta go through all the layers. I see. I do have questions. My question is, what do I do with this battery? That's my only- not my only problem with puzzle games, but the problem I have with puzzle games personally, just in the way that I play them. I have- I get like really hyper-focused on like one little thing, and then like we'll end up doing a bunch of really stupid things because I was like, I have- I know the answer has got to be something to do with this, and it's like, it wasn't at all. Okay. I'm assuming it's still- I'm a little tired from walking. Is it alright if I take a nap? Yeah, of course. Alright. 
Well, I mean, I was going to consider ending it soon, so I guess... So I guess Nico decided that for us. All right, well then, <laughs> thus ends our first journey with one shot. I really like it so far. I know we just started, but I Nico was freaking adorable. The little expressions that mm -hmm. I I love, I love, I love, I love, I love. I'm very excited to get to know more about this world. I'm probably gonna have to go through and like kind of write all the notes down so that I can kind of think through them because I want to actually be able to like follow along with everything and if I don't understand something it'll just go right over my head and so I want to like actually take the time to try and figure out what's going on. But the world is very cool, the gameplay is very cool, the way it knows your name is really cool. That's really neat, I was not expecting that at all, literal jump scare. Oh my gosh. But yeah, I'm gonna keep the outro relatively short. If you are excited for the next episode, please feel free to consider subscribing, that way you get notified. The next episode of this series should be out next Monday at 5 p.m. Eastern Time because it's currently replacing our Deltarune time slot. And if you're new here, please feel free to consider checking out one of some of the other series I've done. We, uh, we've played Omori, which is now, you know, one of, if not my favorite games of all time. We have done Little Nightmares and Little Nightmares 2, Deltarune. I'm currently playing through Your Turn to Die, which is a freaking amazing game. If you haven't played it for yourself, play it for yourself. But if you have, please feel free to come watch me play it because uh, I shed a lot of tears. Yeah, there's a lot of different series you can watch while you wait for the next part. Um, and to those of you who have been here for a while, I, have, I hope you're as excited as I am to take this journey. I know some of you have been asking for it and I'm so excited to be finally doing it. So without further ado, I'm gonna go. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I will see you all next time. Bye! Mm -hmm.